Hello to everyone, it's Savien the Frenchy. Hope you are well. Today I will doing um, a video. It's about uh, a book. Just before I will doing a shout out. It's a shout out to Card Wolf. He's a very uh, friendly guy. He, he get a nice channel. Unfortunately, I haven't got the time to in the past day to to watch some of uh, his video. But uh, in the past week, in one of his uh, video, he, he did a video about this book um, and he said, uh, I advise you, it's really a great book. It's a Lawrence Ritter, Glory of Their Time. Okay, I like to watch the video and when I was able to pick something who I like, I, I succeed to get a copy. And uh, I really fall in love about this book. Uh, Carl Wolf say it's one of my favorite books. I say okay, why not? I will try to read it, and I get this. And this book is fantastic. I don't know if you you know it, but um, uh, Lawrence Witter uh, uh, was uh, I don't know a teacher or something like this in the sixty. Uh, he realized that the Thai Cubs uh, died, and he said, "Oh, a part of baseball memory is uh, is lost." And during the '60s, he traveled uh, across USA in order to get some um, interview of some former player during the the dead ball era, and and he succeeded to get some uh, some player and. Um, he, he meets some player and he just what the player say, he, he not translate, he just put the word uh, of the player on this book and this book is really fantastic. I read one time this book and I will read uh, another time. Just one thing in the, in the preface of the book, he say, just the author say, just listen and it's exactly what he did. When you read the... Um, when you read the, the, the former player, what they say is like you, you listen, but it's really crazy. Of course, there is many, many anecdotes. I will not, uh, so many anecdotes, and I cannot list you even put my, my favorite. Just, just one, one thing what I like a lot about one of my anecdotes, it's uh, Sam Crawford. And Sam Crawford say, oh, he, uh, the author, I uh, get some difficult difficulties to to meet him because he he was not um, a public guy, so he, he preferred to to hide him. And just what he say that that it's crazy, but I'm one hundred and one thousand uh, percent agree with Sam Crawford. He said he said just heck, I don't even buy a newspaper, nothing but trouble in it. Just spoil your day. You get in the morning, feel pretty good, get all of a paper. We can say now some television or internet or whatever or news. And what do you see? Nothing but trouble. Big headline about bombs, war, and misery. It's ruin the day. That's the way I'm look at anyway. Maybe I'm around. I don't know. That is very uh, philosophic phrase because I, I totally agree with it. But anyway, that just want to speak about sport. But very interesting quote um, from Sam Crawford. And uh, very, if you if you love baseball history and you haven't read this book, I really advise you because this read this book is really amazing. And um, I discover many new player and the uh, one of player I, I discovered it's uh, Rob. Rob Maca, Mar Marcard, that's a French name. All the story of the player are very interesting, very, very sound crazy. But I love this story in this book and I succeed to get uh, auto from um, this, um, this player, this very good player during the dead ball era. Thank you for watching. All the best. And if you can read this book, because from far, it's really my favorite sport book I ever read. Thank you for watching. Happy reading. Bye-bye.